In today's video, we're going to talk about ES File Explorer, how you can use it to access your cloud-based accounts. If you have Google Drive, Box, and uh, several others, you can use ES File Explorer to access those. And we're going to show you how to connect your accounts using this tool today. So stand by, we'll show you how. Okay, so let's go into ES File Explorer. And what you'll find on the left-hand side are all the different settings. And I've set up a few shortcuts under Favorite back to where I have my download folder. So if I go into Favorite, you should be able to see those. So I've got a shortcut to my download folder and movies and music and TV shows. Those are the shortcuts, if you will, to the external drive. If you continue to scroll down, there's local library network. So if you hit network, this is where you want to go for setting up your uh, connections to the cloud. Right underneath network, there's LAN, Cloud, FTP, and some additional choices. So clicking cloud, you'll notice I've got a Google Drive account set up underneath my cloud setting, but if you come all the way over to the right, you'll see where you hit new. Clicking on new, you have all these choices now uh, for connecting your file manager to these various different kinds of cloud uh, accounts. We've got Box, SugarSync, Dropbox, OneDrive, Google Drive, that's Amazon, which is uh, S3, Yandex, MegaCloud, Baidu, NetDisk, and MediaFire. And all you need to do is come in, choose the uh, one that you want to set up. This one is uh, for Box. Enter in your email password, and hit authorize, and that's going to go through the process for connecting a Box account for you. And in this example, I've already set up my Google Drive account, so all I need to do once uh, I link to it is click it, it takes me right into it. So what the uh, benefit can be is, if you notice on my Google Drive, I've got my APKs, I've got links to some manuals, some videos, you know, personal documents, pictures, things like that. But I'm also uh, big on this one called APKs. If I click on it, it's pretty fast to respond, and you can see it's going to the cloud and seeing all of my APKs I've downloaded. Uh, I can access right here, so it's very handy if you're on your computer downloading an APK to say your Google Drive or your Box account. Then you can go to your Nvidia Shield, go to your, your um, ES Files, uh, file, ES File Manager, go into your cloud, coming in here and accessing anything. So that'd be another way to access your APKs to install on your Shield, Fire Stick, whatever you might have. I like taking it and backing things up on it and uh, keeping the internal storage uh, empty. So what I was going to do now, just to, to demo that a little bit, I'll go back to uh, my download folder, for example. Scroll up here to my favorites and find my download. I've got some wallpapers I downloaded just for example on how easy it is to do. Or in selecting these, I'm going to Cut. Scroll down to network. Cloud again. There's my Google Drive. There's APKs. I'm going to stick it in that folder. And down on the bottom, it says paste. And it's pasting. And there's the three images that I've put on there. Hit escape, back out, back in. Very fast response, so I'd recommend it for backing things up. Uh, again, downloading some APKs that you want to install, and you don't need to um, go through the trouble of sideloading something onto a USB drive, and plugging it in, and carrying it around. Use the cloud, put your uh, stuff up there. And uh, now what I can do is go back to my favorite and I have my download. And this APK folder here, if I want to, it's already backed up. I could delete it. I don't have anything else on the uh, internal storage except for this folder, so I really don't need the room, but I certainly like having it backed up. So that's how simple it is. And remember, it's not just uh, Google Drive that you can do here. It's all those that we showed you. So if you prefer a different kind of a cloud account, by all means, 
come in here and set it up, going on the cloud and hitting new. You got your Dropbox, which uh, I use, I like. I also got a Boss account, that's great. Uh, but any of these, very easy to set up. It's just that simple. So that's ES File, uh, File Explorer, how you can set up your uh, connectivity to your cloud account that you have. And I hope that this was uh, useful for you. That's it. It's really that simple. We hope you found the video helpful. If you did, share it with others. If you have questions or comments, put them down below. We'll try to get back to you as promptly as possible. And again, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.